My name is Rebecca Snow. I'm the clinical instructor for the Horizon School of Radiography in St. John. I graduated from this same program back in 2015. In between that period of time, I worked all over the province. So I worked in Miramichi, Fredericton, Upper River Valley, and then now back here in my hometown of St. John. So it's nice to be back. I worked in lots of different areas, mostly GenRad, CT, and I was a scrub tech in interventional radiography as well. So I think that kind of diverse experience really lends itself well to my current role as an instructor. GenRad is general radiography, so that's kind of our bread and butter, taking x-rays. It also encompasses fluoroscopy, taking images in the OR, and portable x-rays as well. My name is Raniel Hernandez, and I'm a student here at the Horizon School of Radiography here in St. John. So growing up, I've often been in a hospital setting as a patient, so that kind of inspired me to pursue a career in healthcare. I always had some sort of fascination with medical imaging. Like I found it so cool how we can look into the human body without opening it to see what's going on inside. And after one of my friends introduced me to the program uh, in first year university, I just knew it was the perfect career path for me. The degree through UNBSJ is a four-year Bachelor of Health Sciences with a major in radiography. Now at that point you do your first year at UNBSJ, but then you have two choices. So if you choose the St. John campus, then you would do your kind of a back and forth between UNBSJ and the Horizon School of Radiography St. John, which is right next door. So they're very close together. The Moncton program, which is the same program, just the Moncton campus. It allows students to do what's called an articulated program. So they would do another full year at UNBSJ after their first year, and then they would go to Moncton for two years. So it's the same content, you end up with the same degree, but it just provides students with two different delivery options to suit their, their schedule and their lifestyle a bit better. Students gain the skills necessary to become entry to practice technologists. So on top of getting a bachelor's degree, which allows you to pursue other education if you want to do master's programs and things like that. The kind of hands-on technical skills that we're able to provide allow people to seamlessly enter the workforce after they graduate, which is really appealing to a lot of people. Our schedule alternates between the classroom learning and the clinical rotations. So the clinical rotations really gives us the opportunity to solidify our skills and the knowledge that we learned in the classroom. So being confident in our abilities as a student will allow us to be competent as soon as we enter the workforce, as soon as we graduate. So aside from our clinical component, which as I said is very hands-on, our classroom component also has a lot of hands-on aspects as well, since we realize that a lot of people come into this field because that's what they're looking for. We have a lot of physical learning aids, skeletons, um, physical x-rays. We do a lot of labs, a lot of simulations. So there's a lot of other things other than sitting there and listening to a lecture, which I think appeals to a lot of people. The instructors in our program, they want us to succeed. They, we can tell they care about us as students and without their hard work, their knowledge and all the resources they provide to us, uh, we, would, we wouldn't be able to progress as students. So I'm in my third year of the program, looking back at what I've learned so far and how much knowledge I've actually gained throughout the program, it's honestly mind-blowing. One of my biggest highlights so far has been uh, being able to go to other places outside of the Diagnostic Imaging Department, so places like the operating room to help with certain operations and even forensic cases downstairs in the morgue. There's so many opportunities right now within Horizon in all kinds of different capacities. So there's a lot of opportunities right now for casual work. And there's a lot of change happening in the workforce right now, which will lend itself well to there being a lot of permanent jobs in the near future. A career in radiography is, is so diverse and it's such a nice balance between patient care and technology. It's constantly advancing. So it's a really great balance for people who are still looking for that patient care aspect to their job, but also want that technology. The most rewarding part of this program really is just being able to learn how to help these people each and every day.